Well, I now have a new panel of guests, and with me here is rock legend Jimmy Barnes, Harvey Norman's Jerry Harvey, and Home and Away star Lynn McGranger. Thanks for joining us, guys. Thank you. Now, Jimmy, you were actually in Bali when the blast went off, weren't you? Yeah, it was, um, uh, I guess, but by the grace of God, I wasn't in there. Um, mm. Uh, uh, in been, fact, your been, daughters had been at the Surrey Club on the Thursday night, hadn't yeah, they? Yeah, on the Thursday, a couple of nights, I think, they'd actually been yeah. down there. We were doing, uh, we did a couple of shows in the Hard Rock there, and, um, uh, you know, my kids just went out and went to the bar where all the, all the young Aussies were going, and that was the, the Surrey Club, and, uh, you know, I'm just, you know, I, I guess, you know, it's one of those things that really makes you realise how how much you have to cherish every moment you have with your loved ones because, you know, but by the grace of God, they, you know, they could be gone. Um, uh, really, my heart goes out to anybody out there who lost loved ones or anybody who's injured because it's just, you know, it's, it's a true tragedy, it's, you know. What was it like for you that night? Because you'd been out to dinner, hadn't you, somewhere? Yeah. I, I, I literally had been to some friends' place having dinner. Uh, we left, uh, we were thinking actually, because it was our last night in Bali, we were thinking about you know, uh, going down to Legging Street and doing a little bit of shopping with, with the youngest daughter. And, um, uh, but, you know, we were tired, uh, we had to fly the next day. And um, it was just, you know, uh, you know, we, we decided to go home. We drove home. I literally got back into my hotel room. The phone rang. It was our friends from dinner saying, don't leave your hotel. I looked at the sky. There's flashes. We could see the flames. It was just, you know, a nightmare. Um, I, you sort of, uh, I guess we uh, felt, uh, you know, very vulnerable, very, mm. um, you know, and very helpless. There was not much, you know, just didn't realise anything you could do. I think that's the thing, isn't it? In Bali, you, you really do expect to be safe, don't you? It's such a... It's an entertainment, it's a party island, and it's where you go to relax. It is, and it's, you know, it is, and it has been for a long time. It's a sort of mecca for young Australians just to mm. go and relax. And, and the whole atmosphere, in Bali, that's my first trip, the whole atmosphere there is very laid back. They're very gentle people. Um, all, the, all the Aussies and, and, and the Brits and everybody that are on holiday there are just, you know, they're just in a totally uh, defenceless mode. They're, yeah. they're literally let their guards down after a big year, a lot of those footy clubs and stuff. And, and they're just there to just relax and have a good time and it was just, you know, it was a horrible thing, you know. It really is. Well, you're not just here to talk to us, you're also here to perform for us, so I'm going to let you go and, and prepare away. for that. You can sneak <laughs> off. I'll be the guy sneaking and away I'll when you're looking for And I'll speak to Jerry. <laughs> Thank you for that. Yeah.